talking about thank you letters for teachers and a hack that will save you tons of time. So at Thanksgiving every year, right before the kids go on holiday break, all of the teachers in our district are handed a stack of thank you letters from the parents. I love this idea. So what the parents do right before Thanksgiving break, they're actually due this week, so I am in full thank you letter writing mode. You write letters to all the staff and the teachers that, ha that you are appreciative of. So we have everything from bus drivers to the cafeteria workers to the office staff to all the teachers. And we've been in the district for three years. We have four kids. Uh, do the math, we have a lot of thank you letters to write. So I've created a little hack. If you have lots of thank you letters to write in bulk, I got you covered. And I even have a cute little thank you template. So you can use this and write all of your thank you letters in no time while the meaning and sentiment will still be there. You will save lots of time doing this little hack. So anyways, here is how I do it. I use PicMonkey and I'm using the free template and you'll have the download link below. All right guys, I'm gonna show you how I use PicMonkey to write my thank you letters in bulk. I'm using the free template available at digitalmomblog.com slash thank you. You can download it there and we'll walk through the whole process of writing thank you letters in bulk. So here's pickmonkey.com. I'm going to edit a photo from the computer and I'm gonna pull up the thank you, thank you stationery. And it's gonna open it. This is so easy guys. And believe me, this will save you a ton of time and you'll still get your meaningful thank you notes out. So um, I'm gonna go over here and you, this is gonna show me how to, to add text. So very easy, I'm gonna add text here. And the other thing is, is with when you're printing it, some letters are gonna be longer than others. You can still fill the entire space um, just by adjusting the font size. It's so super simple. So um, I'm going to write a letter to Mrs. Bright. Um, and I'm just gonna write you so much, a quick letter of thanks. I wrote a quick and easy letter and I'm going to change the point size, select all and make it fit. Um, something, so here you can just drag the text to wherever you want to make sure that it's centered. And um, the other cool thing is that you can actually select the text. I'm gonna just make her name a little bit um, bigger and uh, Sincerely, and we always, our whole family name, we use Smezzy. So um, I'm just going to do this. Uh, what did I put, 184? I'm gonna leave a little bit room because we all of our family will sign this. Um, but it's as easy as that. So there you go, that I've written my thank you letter. Super simple, that took me, what, a minute, two minutes to write. Um, I'm going to save this and then print this, and I'm gonna show you how to export a uh, graphic file in PicMonkey. It's very easy. All you have to do is hit export. It's gonna confirm your settings. You're just gonna to wanna to keep everything the same. And so I'm going to type Ms. Bright, and we're saving this as a PNG. You can save it as a JPEG as well. I just prefer PNG. Export to computer, and super simple save and there you have it it's exported um you can also save it to your hub um if you want uh, there's thank you stationary and it will be saved to your it's basically like think about your pick monkey cloud account um you can save it there and uh you might want to save one just so you have it where well, you can always come back so if you're like in the middle of writing so this actually, um, I don't know if I mentioned this and I may have, but this works great for like baby showers and wedding showers, birthday parties, anything like that. Just do them in bulk like this. Um, it's just a matter of getting the thank you letter to them. That's all that matters is of course a handwritten letter would be amazing. But if someone saw my handwriting, I think they would probably just appreciate my, my type letter better because my handwriting is 
chicken scratch. I will just, it's just really sad. <laughs> but anyways, um, so I'm done with this. I can go on to the next letter. Uh, you know, it's very, very, very simple. Um, again, thank you so much for all that you do. And if you want to change the font, all you have to do is select it. I'm pretty much using um, Poppins for the body and then I'm just sprucing it up with Coffee Break for the names just to give it a little pop and look a little um, more jazzy. And again, you know, it's very simple to adjust. Um, there's also other options in PicMonkey if you wanted to add graphics or what have you. I'm keeping it very simple because we have a lot to write and that's it guys that's really it so if you i actually did purchase a little bit heavier stock uh, it's like resume paper just to have a nice stock paper for these to be printed on um and then i'm just going to fold them up and put them in a pretty envelope uh, for my kids i'm actually having the kids draw little pictures for their main teachers um, but for the other teachers, we're just all signing these, putting them in envelopes and passing them on. They will be getting a slew of letters. And again, it's the thought that counts. And that's it. That's how you uh, write these in, I'm sorry, how you create these in bulk in PicMonkey. And I hope this helps. And if you have any questions, leave them in the comments. But that is how I write my thank you letters in bulk. Uh, again, it's the thought that counts and really the letters of gratitude, even if your school doesn't do this, this is something that I strongly suggest that you guys do for your teachers or anyone that you appreciate. Maybe it's a neighbor, maybe it, you know how an unexpected thank you note can just really cheer up somebody's day and it's quick and simple. Also, don't forget, I actually have this template and uh, downloadable on my website at digitalmomblog.com slash thank you and you will be able to download this for free and again just watch you know you can follow the steps and you too will be cranking out them thank you notes in bulk so there you have it i hope that helps be grateful right those teachers you guys sit in the classroom for like i don't know an hour and you will quickly realize how thankful you should be for your teachers. There's no way I can do it. Thank you, teachers. <laughs> and anyways, that's it for today. I hope this was helpful. Give it a thumbs up if it was. And make sure you subscribe and uh, leave a comment um, down below and tell me how you appreciate, how you show appreciation to your teachers. Because with the holidays, we are all looking for ways to show gratitude. Anyways, have a good one and we'll see you next time. Bye.